you guys it's Karen and I have got a dupe for you I'm so excited because I used to do a lot of dupe videos didn't I but I think I don't buy as many high-end things now and so I wouldn't know if something I was using was a dupe if that makes sense but um, I've had the benefit Hula Light for a long time and I was very excited when it came out because I struggled to find a light enough bronzer for me um, and I just had a funny feeling that this would be it. I was a bit put off when I watched reviews saying this does nothing, it does absolutely nothing, this is no good for anybody and then when I tried it I was like oh yeah this is perfect for me, that's how pale I am. Even with a fake tan this Hula Light bronzer works for me but if you are also looking for a dupe of the Benefit Hula bronzer, not the light version, I think this will be good for you as well because there's different colours in what I'm showing you. So the dupe that I have found is the e.l.f. Sheer Tint Finishing Powder. So I bought this, I'm not sure if this is new or not, um, but I either hadn't paid attention to it or just hadn't seen it, but it is a translucent finishing powder, so just a face powder. And this one is in light slash medium. So it comes in fair light, light medium and medium dark. And so this light medium is the dupe for Hula Light. And I think that the medium dark is most likely going to be a dupe for the original Hula Bronzer. So I sometimes give you dupes that I say are very alike, but not exactly the same. The only difference in these two is or well, the only thing that makes them different is the ingredients. But the number one ingredient on both of them, therefore the highest is talc. So they are both based upon talc. Um, price wise, the Hula Light is £25.50. The e.l.f. one is £7.50. So a huge difference in price. Um, this one, Benefit are not cruelty free. E.l.f. are cruelty free. E.l.f. is available in Boots and Superdrug, so a lot more available to us in the UK than Benefit. I prefer the packaging of the E.l.f. one, but that's, I know, a personal preference. I've never liked these sort of boxes from Benefit. Um, but everything else in how they apply is identical. So let me show you now me applying them this morning because I can't even remember which way round, but I've got Benefit on one side and the E.l.f. on the other. Okay, so the brush I'm using is, this is a bronzer, a Sephora Bronzer 44 brush. I thought I'd use a nice dense brush so you can see, really see the difference in colour um, or the lack of difference in colour. Uh, this is the Hula Bronzer Light and so I shall use this on the right side. So I'm just going to go in a few times. Maybe give that a little blow so I'm not loading it up. You know me, I'm a fan of going overboard. People, there's a lot of people have talked about this bronzer as it not even showing on, on their skin, but I've got a fake tan on and look how much that shows, you know. So just do it around my head. Okay, so that is, I'm just gonna make sure there's none left on there from the Hula bronzer. And then go to the e.l.f. Make sure I've got the right one because I've got two of these. So this is e.l.f. in light to medium. Go in there a couple of times. That's that side. So you can see they go on exactly the same. I think that side maybe looks ever so slightly more pigmented. They're both as smooth. They've both got the same amount of powder. I've actually, oh no, I haven't blown that one off. Like even looking at them, there's the same amount of powder kick up, you know? Um, that's them together there. As you could hopefully see they apply exactly the same they're the same shade let me show you them together um the same you know they're both matte neither of them has any shimmer in at all that's them side by side um i have to say side by side like that sorry this is tricky to hold the this elf one looks like it might be a tad darker but actually on the skin i don't think that that translated at all i think it looked exactly the same um and lasting wise they're both pretty much the same if anything the elf one lasted longer on me um because i have always found with the benefit hula and also with what's the other popular one the two-faced milk chocolate they sort of break up on me and sometimes there's a little line here and not so much now my skin is dry I have to say I didn't notice it so much with these they both lasted well all through the day but that's what used to happen with the hula whereas these both lasted 
perfectly fine on me um, and if anything the elf one was showing a little bit more because I've, I've tested it before today just to see how it went that's everything to tell you about this dupe i'll list both colors in the description for you i'm still keeping an eye out for a dupe of the bare minerals invisible bronze because that is absolutely beautiful but i don't use it very much simply because it's a higher end one and so it's more expensive but i do love that one as well um, but i'm so chuffed to have this elf one so that's everything i'll list all of my makeup in the description as well thank you so much for watching and i'll speak to you again soon